Simone Pratola. Hi, I'm Martina Generali. Hi, I'm Francesca. And we are the directors of La Notte. The film is a collection of suggestions that came to my mind from many listens I had of Antonio Vivaldi's piece, La Notte. Some suggestions are directly inspired by the second and fifth movements of the piece, which are called Ghosts and Sleep. Others, such as the Commedia dell'arte mask Puccinella, Venice and the Carnival, are not taken from the piece, but belong to the same imagery. I work on the visual development, backgrounds, character design, animation and storyboard of the short. I took part in the project later on during the development of the story. During the production I was mainly in charge of the layout and animation and uh, I was also responsible for uh, updating the editing throughout the process. In addition to the concept, I mainly worked on the storyboard and animation. The storyboard was built on the music since the pre-production on a MIDI version arranged by composer Fulvio Chiara. In this way, we had a very precise editing which helped us with the syncs for the visual. We developed masks that uh, were as varied as possible and inspired by pop figures and classical costume mixed with uh, modern symbols. Among all these, Pulcinella is the only traditional mask of the Commedia dell'arte and the only one expressive who has a mouth and manifests emotions. The woman with whom Pulcinella falls in love is the only mask among the VIPs to have uh, human features. The backgrounds were for me the most challenging aspect of the shot. We decided to play with a lot of colors and contrast to impress the viewer. Visually, the story can be divided into three macro sequences, the sunset, the party and the escape. While we start by introducing the spectator into the mysterious and peaceful Cali of Venice, we end up deconstructing the city and architecture throughout the escape, and Pulcinella ends up play and interacting with the lights and the reflections. Finally, once the animation, the grounds and compositing were finished, the music was performed live by the Fossano Musica Foundation keeping the rhythm and sync of the arrangement score. The film is meant to be a listening guide for the viewer, but at the same time it is meant to reinforce the narrative of the music. It is the music that inspired the suggestion, and the suggestion itself which tells the music. We hope you enjoy! Ciao! Ciao. <laughs>